My name is Dushan and this is Art Smart Online. Art Smart is an art program for primary school children who want to improve their artistic skills through a range of fun and stimulating exercises. My name is Dushan and I would like to welcome you to this revolutionary edition of Art Smart. In this lesson, you will learn how to see the geometry of nature by creating a painting of Sydney Harbour in a Cezanne-esque pictorial style. The subject of this lesson will be one of the great cityscapes of the world, the Sydney Harbour Bridge and the Sydney Opera House. Between 1870 and 1910, Western society witnessed more technological progress than in the previous four centuries. During this period, inventions such as photography, cinematography, sound recording, the telephone, the automobile and the airplane heralded the dawn of a new age. In the same way that technology was extending the boundaries of communication and travel, artists began to experiment with new approaches to painting to reflect this modern age. Paul Cezanne is known as the father of modern art because his paintings broke with tradition and expanded the possibilities of art. One of the most striking features of Cezanne's paintings is the way he simplifies his subjects. In Mont Saint Victoire, Cezanne ignored surface detail and reduced the landscape into its most basic geometric forms and shapes. Cezanne painted this large limestone mountain over 60 times. In this later version, he distorts the landscape into an almost abstract mosaic of colour. Can you observe which geometric shapes Cezanne has used in this painting? For this lesson, you will need one piece of white A3 paper, a lead pencil, a rubber, a black permanent marker, and your choice of oil pastels, watercolours, or acrylic paints. Shall we begin? First, we are going to transform Sydney Harbour into a simplified world of geometric shapes. You can pause the video to copy the final composition of shapes or you can follow along. We are now ready to add colour. You can choose a colour scheme which reflects your own mood and experience or you may want to use the colours which I have chosen. For this demonstration, I am using acrylic paint and my colours are lemon yellow, crimson and ultramarine blue. I also use black and white to create some dark and light tones. And here it is, Sydney Harbour after Cezanne. What an amazing painting! We would love to see what you have done at home. So can you send us a photo of your artwork uh, to our education officer, Julie? Her email is jdanilov at wollongong.nsw.gov.au.